It's Pelio from Editing Visuals and in today's video I will be showing you guys how to make the grungy shutter effect. Before we start the tutorial I just want to let you guys know that we recently launched a new editing pack called the Color Glitch Pack and you guys can use the discount code PELLE to save $10. Let's get right into the tutorial here. So we're going to start off by choosing a clip here. I'm using a clip here of Central C. And after you're choosing a clip, you're going to be making a adjustment layer. So Control Alt Y. And for this grungy shutter effect, we're going to start off by adding the effect noise. And I would say this noise effect is probably one of the most important effects to use when making like grungy effects. You're going to set the amount of noise to 20%. And after that, you're going to uncheck the use color noise. And you will get this kind of noise here. Looks pretty clean. After that, we're going to be adding a effect called Echo. And we basically add this effect to get that shuttering effect now. We're going to change the number of echoes to 5 and the decay to 0.7. And the echo operator is going to be screen. This is how it looks now. Pretty cool effect, but to enhance this shutter effect even more, we're going to be adding post rise time. And I'm going to set the frame rate to 8. So now it's really going to start lagging here a bit, which looks good in my opinion. And when we added the echo effect, it started to be kind of desaturated this uh, clip here. So we're going to be adding curves now. And we're adding curves basically to play around a little bit with the contrast. For the curves here, I'm going to make a, a dot here and then I'm going to drag to something like this. I don't want to make it brighter, I just want to make it a little bit, a little bit darker because it's already pretty bright. And this is how it looks now. Looks pretty pretty cool in my opinion. So here when the clip switches, we're going to cut the adjustment layer, just like that. And then to the end of this clip, there we go, next clip. So now when you add the effect to certain sections of the video, this is how it's going to look. And I think it's a very very clean effect you can use for your edits, music videos or whatever you're making. And now to save this, if you want to use this uh, later on, you're going to go into the adjustment layer, mark all of the effects here, animation, save animation preset. And here you're just going to name your effect, press save, and then you can add it. So grungy shutter, save, and now you have your preset saved. If you like this tutorial, don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video. And if you really want to elevate your editing even more, check out our website, editingvisual.com. Our editing packs there will really take your editing to the next level. Also, don't forget to check out our socials and join our Discord server. And I will see you guys soon. Take care and have a nice day.